Communications Minister Simon de Nobrega says Trinidad TTT Limited is moving ahead to become self-sufficient. This he says even though the state-owned media house is still dependent on government subvention. Contributing to the debate in the House of Representatives this morning, Minister de Nobrega says TTT has been able to increase its viewership, especially at this time of the COVID-19 pandemic, where the station has played a critical role in moderating all of the Ministry of Health's virtual COVID-19 press conferences. He added that the company is still very relevant, also partnering with the Ministry of Education to broadcast educational content for students who are at home. The minister said TDT has been focusing on its own internal improvements, which are still on track. During the last fiscal, TDT initiated a company-wide infrastructure update upgrade sorry, aimed at improving operational efficiency and its overall broadcast quality. Critical pieces of equipment were received and understandably the in, in the implementation of the initiative has been delayed by COVID-19. It is now expected to be completed by the end of the second quarter of this fiscal. Minister De Nobrega says the station also falls within the plans of the Office of the Prime Minister's Communication Division for the next fiscal year. For the ensuing year, a budget of $3 million has been allocated to the continued strategic redevelopment of TTT as it deepens its commitment to bringing relevant content to its audiences. There will be a distinct focus on telling the unique story of Trinidad and Tobago, and the various perspectives of different groups will be profiled as a mechanism for citizens to better understand and appreciate each other. Minister De Nobrega said TDT, TDT will also play an integral role to produce carnival-related content to fill the void in the celebration in 2021.